Hello students, now we are going to discuss about the approval process and timeline required for ANDA abbreviated new drug application right so abbreviated new drug means generic drug products right so which is not the branded drug which we have discussed already in unit one what is the branded drug what is the generic drug so for this also FDA approval it is required right so what is the process and how what is the time it is required let's discuss right so the topic is approval process and timeline involved in ANDA abbreviated new drug application right so in ANDA abbreviated new drug application contains data submitted to FDA food drug and administration once again it is the governing body it is also approving the generic drug also it is not that the only the branded drug only need the approval no generic drug also need approval for review and approval of a generic drug product what for for manufacture and marketing because the person who will uh, the company will go for the uh, manufacture of the generic drug uh, they will, they are going to take the patent expired the drug patent expired drug then only they for that also they need to file the approval and then only they can go for manufacturing and marketing to provide safe effective it should be safe and effective definitely that is the primary and preliminary requirement lower cost and alternative to the brand name drug so that everybody can afford that one and that we have discussed already so what is the approval process with the fda the first applicant or those who are uh, the uh, uh, manufacturer they are going to file the ANDA application to fda right so uh, this uh, it is going to forwarded to the OGD Office of Generic Drug of CDER Center for Drug Evaluation and Research right so again here it is going to review the review by the uh, Office of Generic Drug OGD of uh, the Center for Drug and Evalu Drug Evaluation and Research they are going to review in this particular measure four points that is the bioequivalence of the particular new molecule uh, the the new drug which is the generic going to be the generic drug whether it is having bioequivalence as the branded or innovator drug or not chemistry what is the chemistry behind that particular molecule or particular drug all right then plant inspection where it is going to manufacture whether it is having all the facility all the uh, the equipment and machineries involved uh, for that manufacturing of that particular generic drug that is there or not they, those things they are going to inspect label review what are the what is the kind of label it is going to have whether it is indicating it is generic drug or not all those things they are going to review and once they will review they if it is acceptable result they will approve for marketing the marketing approval it is going to be granted and they can the particular company the pharmaceutical company they can manufacture and they can go for the marketing right so here the in the heading timeline involved in ANDA so timeline within eight months of submission right conditions if pre-approval inspection not required right if pre-approval inspection required within 10 months of submission it is going to take if pre-approval inspection is required right so this we have to see if it is not required it is eight months if it is required it is going to be the 10 months so this is the timeline it is required right so this inspection we are talking about so ANDA is also one of the major step it is not generally the talk is that a patent expired drug can be manufactured by the any company no it's also required uh, approval because uh, ultimately the drug it is going to used by the patient and the people they should not have any side effect any adverse event and at the same time it should give the therapeutic effect as the branded drug thank you